As a Java developer, learning Spring Framework is a really important thing for everyday day-to-day -day uses. Whatever the application that you build using Java, most of them are built on Spring Framework, which is Spring Framework 6 and Spring Boot Framework 3. Those are the latest versions of Spring Framework. So learning those frameworks is essential for you as a Java developer. To help you out each and every one of you, we have created a course regarding Spring Boot 3 and Spring Framework 6, which will cover a lot of details. It will cover the topics like what is Spring Framework, why we should use Spring Framework and the basics of Spring Framework, which will help you to get the knowledge about the Spring Framework, what are the nitty gritties and all the details about the Spring Framework. And then you will learn about the different concepts regarding the Spring Framework, inversion of control, dependency injections, bean scopes, bean creation and lot more. You will also learn what is the use of a Spring Boot Framework, what was the world before that and what are the differences and the benefits that it brings to the table. And you will also learn how to create your applications using the Spring Boot framework. So you will learn how to create a production grade ready application using Spring Boot 3 framework. You will also learn the different Spring projects within the Spring Boot 3. Like you will also learn about the Spring Data JDBC, how you can connect your application to JDBC using the JDBC templates, using the native SQL queries and all those stuffs. You will also learn about the GPA as well. That is the Java Persistence API. How to work with GPA in Spring Boot Framework. How it is different from JDBC and how GPA is helpful for our day-to-day -day activities. How GPA is helpful to have the better performance in our application. How you can create the projections, how you can create the native queries, how you can create the JPQL queries, all those stuffs we are going to learn in this course. You will also learn about the different databases connectivity, how you can connect to the different database and how you can create the different queries and everything. You will also learn to create the application which has a proper monitoring for your production grade applications. How you can add the actuators, how the different actuators and different endpoints within the actuator works, how you can create the different profiles for your application. You have the profiles for your lower environment and the higher environment. You have profiles for your different sets of resources. Those are all things that we are going to learn in this course. We are also going to learn how we can connect our application to MongoDB. So we will learn about the MongoDB as well and how we can create the resources of the MongoDB. How we can connect our Spring Boot application with the MongoDB, creating the resources, inserting data, updating data, deleting data and lot more things. We are also going to work with the Kafka, Apache Kafka as well, where we will learn all the things about the Apache Kafka, the architecture, the playground, how we can create the topics and all those things. And we will create the Spring Boot application with Kafka where we can create the Kafka topics, we can publish the Kafka messages and we can consume the Kafka messages as well. So you can see that this is a holy grail of Spring Boot 3 course where you will learn each and everything about the Spring Boot. So where you will learn that what all things that you require to create the Spring Boot 3 application alongside all the surrounded dependency as well. So whenever you are working with any of the organization and you're working with the Spring Boot application, you're going to work with Spring Boot plus any of the database or most probably 99% you are going to work with Apache Kafka or any no SQL databases as well. So we are going to learn all those things in details so that if you have to use any of this thing in your day to day projects, then you will be easily able to learn all those things. This is not going to be a really lengthy course, but it will cover each and every topic in detail, which will help you to work in your day to day activities. So this is all about the course details. If you are interested to enroll in this course, then I have added the link in the description below. You can just go to dailycodebuffer.in to enroll in this course. For the first 200 students, you will get a 60% discount using the code SPRING3. So hurry up and if you are interested, just use this code and enroll in this course. The entire course is uploaded. You can just enroll in this course and start learning about the Spring Boot Framework, which is the latest and greatest, that is the Spring Boot 3 and Spring Framework 6 and all the details around it. I will be available in the discussion forum of the course. So if you have any doubts regarding any of the things, we can discuss over there uh, while going through the course. So you will have the proper support as well while you are going through the course. And if you have your friends as well or your colleagues who want to learn the Spring Boot 3 Framework and the Spring Framework 6, you can share this video with them as well and you can enroll in this course. So I hope you take the benefit of this course and enroll in this course if you are in interested and if you're not enjoying the course you can always take the refund within the first 30 days of your enrollment so no question asked you will get your refund back so that's when it take the advantage of the course and i will see you in that course in the discussion forum 
and in the course as well and i will see you back in the next video happy coding bye bye